This is uh, the uh, young lace monitor, Goanna, Varanus Varius, and uh, he's to be released today at Hawkesbury River. He, uh, uh, he lost most of his tail, and uh, these guys store a lot of fat in the tail to get through the winter, and um, it's only a hope that he still has enough tail to store enough fat for the winter. Also, uh, they use their tail as a weapon, so he now is behind the eight ball in the wild because he doesn't have a tail as he's growing up. These are apex predators, but at this age, they are prey to many animals, including snakes. So they use their tail as a whipping defense mechanism, but he doesn't have one. And we'll see that in a second as he comes out. Try and ease him out and uh, we'll see that his tail is, is healed excellently. South Penrith Fat Clinic did an excellent job healing, but that tail should be the length of his body, at least. Uh, I think there's enough storage for fat in there to get him through the winter. They uh, mainly store the fat in the top area anyway. So, uh, but I think he's better off in the wild giving it a go than being in captivity just in case. The wild is the best place for him. It's, he, he can do his best. So uh, here he goes. I suspect it was a cat attack because the tail was so mangled that it had to be removed. So the vets actually removed the tail and it's healed up beautifully. They did an excellent job. Suspected cat attack. So he survived the uh, toxic bacteria from the cat's mouth, which is uh, lucky in itself. He's just got me with his claws there. He should dig into a tree instead. So here he goes. I want to see him climb a tree because he hasn't been out in the wild quite a while. Can you get around now, Paulson? Wow, he's oh. really up there. That's what I wanted to see. Either way, that's just beautiful. Now he can steal all the eggs he wants to. What a sight. Well, right up. You wouldn't know he was there. <laughs> 